Okay. Uh, first of all, I would like to thank you for coming to this webinar. And I am Iris Huang, uh, product sales manager of our SPD, the Aon SPD division. So as you, you know that we have several business units, so I'm responsible for promoting uh, Aon SPD products and I'm based in the Netherlands office. So uh, after this webinar, if you have any questions, f feel free to drop me an email or contact me for further product inquiries. Okay. Um, so I'm going to start with our uh, Aon SPD AI product lines. So you may know we offer a couple of solution of the most popular platforms from Intel, NVIDIA, High Silicon, and Google. Uh, NVIDIA is the mainstream product line we are trying to promote, but for some customers, if they're interested, we do offer Intel solution with uh, MiraX, also High Silicon uh, products. And it, recently, we started to build a Google products. The next slide to go in, is going to give you a brief glance about how we can provide our AI solution. Start from the en entry level product like uh, Google HTTP or JSON Nano, all the way up to JSON TX2, EarnX, AGX, and Xeon Grade. If you have any questions for your projects, then you don't know how to select, then you can look at this slide. The basic applications such as object detection, mask de detection, or people counting, that's all can start with the entry level products. But if you do need some high performance product, then you can all the way go, uh, go to JVM and X for robot or autonomous machines applications. So today's main focus is about our NVIDIA product. So we have four main product lines aligned with NVIDIA uh, JSON family. So start from the first one we launch is the Boxer 81 series, which is TX2, and then goes to JSON Nano. After that, we actually launched the JVR AGX, and the latest launch one is the JVR NX, NX launch in end of April. So the NVIDIA JSON family actually, as you can see from here, the JSON Nano offers 0, 0 0.5 uh, teflops, and then for TX2 and NX, they actually provide a very, the price listed on NVIDIA website is actually quite a, the same, like 399. However, the performance is different. For example, TX2 is actually up to 1.3 tops, but NX, JV and NX can go all, all the way up to 21 tops. In the end, and we have a winner, which is uh, AGX Xavier, which can go all the way up to 32 tops. The performance is around 20 times better than TX2. So this chart, this table is just to show you what's the different features they have based on the different modules, AI modules. Okay, so I will go, I will start to talk about some fee features about our product, but I'm not going to detail because uh, all the specifications you can find on our website because there are too many selections. I think in a short time, we wouldn't really uh, remember it within this uh, one hour uh, webinar. So for detailed specifications, you can refer to our website. But for JSON TX2, as I mentioned, is actually the for men it's actually mainstream product lines we are promoting the same as uh, JV and X. So each model they have different features such as uh, Boxer 8110, they're one on the left side. This is a very compact size. As you can see, it's a little bit larger than a credit card size or maybe the same size as your palm. So uh, very perfect for smart AGV applications or you want to use it indoor for retail, then this is very suitable. 
The second one is Boxer 8120 AI. It con comes with four LAN, so it's perfect for uh, smart parking, smart city, or traffic traffic control applications. And then 8130, the main features of it is it can connect to MEP camera, which we have some customers who use for outdoor applications to to do the moni to monitor the street, the cars, bikes. Okay. Uh, and then all the way goes to our Boxer 8150. Uh, this is the main product I think you are more interested in. Um, it features uh, a USB 3.2 Gen 1 also with, um, it's perfect for a smart retail or some supermarkets uh, monitoring the customer's uh, behaviors, then we can use this products. The last one, belongs to our Justin TX2 family is our Boxer 8170AI. It features four PoE ports, as you can see, it can actually use for security applications or some outdoor um, wildfire monit monitoring or some, or some, even some indoors building monitoring, that's fine. So this is a case we have, or a story we have, one of our customer used in China, and this is in built in supermarkets using our Boxer 8150 AI. And so as you can see from this picture, it actually can, because it has a USB, so it can connect to weight sensors, barcode reader, or NFD, uh, NFC read, readers or even cameras. So reach IO, which can provide you for a com comprehens comprehensive solutions. For just a nano, which it's around 0 0.5 top. So we usually use it for some entry level applications. And it's pound size, very small. IP40, IP40 cases protections uh, also provide a wide range power inputs. So it's actually for some, you can use for some cons between commercial or uh, industrial, you can use for both grades applications. Okay. So I want to give you a a glance at how our roadmap look like in the next few months because we receive lots lots of inquiries for the past uh, one uh, two or three months every week uh, from different regions different countries so as you can see from the slides in q2 we finish our boxer 8240 and this is for high silicon base for china markets and for Boxer 8250 and 8251, this is going to the mass production. We will have some samples ready in June. In case you, you are interested, please contact our salesperson. We will give you the best sample support. And then Q3, we will have four new models launch and I will go, we can look at the, the specification later in my next slides. Uh, in Q4, there is, will be one new product launch, which is our Boxer 8524, features um, JVR and X AI module with a port, API PoE port. Okay. So those are the new members I, I just talked about. Let's take a look at the the different features or the main feature of each product. The first one is A222 and A252. So why do I, why did I list them in the same uh, category? Because actually for Jason Nano and the Jason JVR NX, they, can, they could share the same carry boards. So what we do is we use the same carry board, but we replace them with a different AI modules, which is Nano and JVNX. So from the first one, the main feature is it comes with P, uh, TV, P, 
P power devices, the PD, and e with N.2 E key for Wi-Fi or N SATA for uh, four size MIDI card. The second one is 8223-8253, which features two PoE uh, ports and DIO, also CAN bus. The third one is 8254, which comes to a PoE port I just mentioned, and also we want to make it very powerful for industrial application. So we, we will extra provide uh, one floor size mini car, one half size mini cars, and also one CAN bus. The new members you see here is the 8251 and 82 as I mentioned, will be launched in June. Uh, this is the first JVNX product we have from in Aon. So they can use it for IoT gateway application, that's fine, or for some very um, middle level applications such as like facial detection. We have a cases also in America. The, co the, the state government use it to monitor the uh, visitors in the building to see if they are, well they are wearing the mask or not and also using a camera to detect their body temperature. So this is a complete solution provided by the government and it's using the JVNX. We do have another new product, which is NVIDIA J JV AGX. Uh, this one enhanced the old IO exp exp expansions, such as N.2 E key and M key. Also comes with uh, four PoE ports. Uh, and I want to look at what does NVIDIA JSON software stack includes. So as you can see here, actually every JSON software stack includes some uh, Dipstream SDK and also some software modules you can use for motion detections, pass planning, or also gest gesture detections, all the different modules for end users or their applications. Let's look at the Jetpack. Okay, so Jetpack 4.3 uh, is actually comes with a BSP uh, driver level and also con including the CUDA toolkit or CUDA deep narrow work network. Also TensorFlow to optimize, optimize the inference uh, computing power. Also comes with the OpenCV. OpenCV is a tool for image, uh, per, uh, image detections or some machine vision applications. So all the Jetpacks also includes the OS image libraries and some API applications. Uh, developer tools. When when you use start to use NVIDIA products, you don't have to worry about like I need to develop my own uh, my 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 own op optimizing tools. No, you don't have to. You just use it, and it comes with very comprehensive solutions. Iris, we have a really short question just okay. um, to make sure uh, from Mache. If uh, UART means Modbus. Uh, pardon? Could you repeat your question? Yeah, you can see it in the chat also. Okay. Uh, if UART Wait, means uh, Modbus. In the chat. In the chat. Sorry. I was looking for the chat. Oh, sorry. We can ask. We can maybe answer it at the at the end. Okay. Uh, okay. Maybe we can answer it at the end. Sure. Okay. Yeah. I was looking for the the chat. Where is the chat? No okay. Problem. You can continue. Mm -hmm. 
Mm, okay. Um, so when you purchase the NVIDIA develop kit from NVIDIA, and it actually comes with a uh, develop board with the AI module and with the Ubuntu 18.04, but for ACE, our AM products, we actually make some improvements in customizations. We use our customized kernels, also customize the desktop environments. Um, also as a features to make it more user friendly. So this is all as support from AM, which if you do need some support for some customizations, you can also contact our AM software team. So usually when you when you buy NVIDIA products, uh, you can down you can also download the SDK managers. So SDK manager help you to upgrade your all the BSVs, drivers, tools, libraries, source code uh, in the NVIDIA product. So this is very good. You can check on the website and also download it when you buy any NVIDIA product. Okay. Uh, if you're interested to know the, the questions or when you use NVIDIA product, you have questions, this is a good tool. Like you can find the NVIDIA fol uh, developed fallen 